Good afternoon. I'm here to present a summary of the Mellow accomplishments for the Department of Psychology. The Mellow group for the Department of Psychology consisted of four graduate students, Kira, Alicia, Adina, that's me, and Jay, and of course our esteemed professor, Dr. Malley. Oh, whoops. There he is. While the four graduate students each completed individual projects, something that we all did was undergo the Merlot grape training and create personal collections. Here's an example of Jay Holden's collection. His, like ours, contains learning objects that we can use in the courses that we teach. These courses ranged from intro to psych to cognitive psych. I myself taught psychology of human sexuality. Kira interviewed other psychology professors in our department and found that most of them were looking for case studies for their students. She created a collection specifically for this purpose of case studies. Here's an example from Kira's collection about a client with schizophrenia. Students can navigate through, it's a flash software, uh, undergoing looking at the symptoms and creating a treatment. Jay created an interesting project where he used clips from television and movies to teach basic psychological concepts. His project, hosted through our university but available through Merlot, typically shows a short clip from a television show or movie, followed by information about the concept, uh, which is followed by a brief question or assignment for the student to test their knowledge. This example features a clip from The Office and teaches conditioned responses through classical conditioning. Using this same Jing software, both Jay and myself created a tutorial for students to use PsychInfo. This tutorial included a five-minute video guiding students through the PsychInfo database and then a brief 10-question assignment. Jay and I also worked to publicize the work of the first-year students in creating a cross-discipline collection in Merlot. The cross-discipline collection is a 17-item collection that essentially aims to level the playing field for incoming students by teaching them rudimentary skills that are applicable across all disciplines. For example, presentation skills or learning how to conduct a basic research paper. Coming from cognitive psych, Alicia sought to create exercises that would test student knowledge of almost mathematical cognitive psych concepts. She utilized software known as Hot Potato, a free software available on the internet to create multiple choice questions that students could complete and immediately check their answers upon as exercise. Lastly is the work of Dr. Brian Malley, who has led many workshops in the creation of LOs and Merlot in general. He's also working with the statistics folks in our group to create a new LO name called Name That Scenario. On behalf of Dr. Brian Malley, myself, and the other graduate students, I say thank you for your time.